Bruce Siegel, and LinkedIn has gotten even better since I presented to the Coronet team in January. In this five-minute overview, I'm going to show you how in seven ways. The first is relationship management and follow-up. You can click on a connection, and I got here through this connections tab up top, and now I'm going to click on Rich Gavalia, and I will see a reminder of how he and I met, which is something that I input just before this call. I can edit it, or if there was nothing here, I can put it in for the first time. It's really good if you have a lot of connections and meet a lot of people and then a lot of time elapses. More importantly, LinkedIn can remind you to follow up periodically. And that's this reminder. Follow up in a week, a month. Now many of you may have follow up systems for high priority prospects and clients. LinkedIn might be good for those that are more periodic to keep on a tickler every six months, for example. The second thing I want to show you is an improvement that LinkedIn has made to the group interface. Now it's easier to view your group interface and see which have the most recent activity. And since I checked this morning, there's been one new discussion here in the Net Promoter Score forum, so I can uh, know to follow up there. Usually there's a lot more showing here of discussions that I should be following up on. It's also easy to change the order of the groups, move certain one of these up top if I check them more frequently. The third thing I can do is to help identify prospect companies. And I go to Interests, Companies, and I'm going to search for Duke Energy which I understand is a prospect of Coronet. And you will see that there are other companies like Duke Energy that LinkedIn is suggesting to me as possible prospects. I think this would be great for smaller sp prospects in a specific niche companies to I'd see companies that you may not have heard of. There's a similar feature for your connections. If there's a person that you're interested in, LinkedIn will suggest other people. The other thing that LinkedIn does now is you can see who's viewed your updates. So there's a really nice feature here where I've done three updates recently. And if I click on here, you can see how many likes I just got. So I got three likes for telling people about the new Straight Talk uh, update. And then before that, something for my lawyer connections, I didn't get any likes, but I did get 85 views. Now, if I'm going to update my profile, which is profile, edit profile, and say I'm making a series of updates over a week period, and I don't want people to see that, I can, on this bar on the right here, change it to no, do not publish these changes. The other thing that LinkedIn, the, the, the fifth thing, the sixth thing that LinkedIn has done, which I really like under profiles, is they've made the endorsements easier to hide or to at least reduce the number of notifications that you get about endorsements because I find these very distracting. So you go down to wherever your endorsements are on your profile, you hit edit, and you can see choices to whether you want to be endorsed and how often you might want to be included uh, in endorsement section uh, suggestions, for example, to your clients. The seventh thing that's great is new benefits for premium members. And if you go back to my profile, you'll see that I have a new background that helps me become me more visible as a premium member. I can also see how well I'm, my profile is ranking in profile views. We'll just take a moment to do that. Go back to the home page. 
go to the right, and you can see that my ranking is improving recently, and I am now in the top 16% among my connections. So I'm pretty visible, considering that I'm up against some real, real, real gurus, publishers like Vivica von Rosen over here. But as I said in January, most of you can leverage the basic program to a greater extent. So in summary, go forth, build relationships, and let me know how I can help. It's Bruce Siegel, S-E-G-A-L-L, -L, at gmail.com if you want to reach me. Thank you.